People are hitting the slopes tonight at Bittersweet Ski Resort in Otsego. Cannonsburg in Kent County isn't open yet, but meteorologist Michael Barons is headed south of Grand Rapids. He joins us now at Bittersweet. And Michael, how are things there? You know, it's uh, been an active night here at Bittersweet. They've got the lights on. They've got the slopes open. People are out there skiing and snowboarding for what has only been a couple of days so far this year. In fact, you can see over to my left is actually a line forming to go up the hill there at the ski lift because this is about, I think, only the fourth day they've been able to uh, have things open here at Bittersweet. And the good news is the cold weather that we've had is really going to help them out. They make a lot of their snow here at Bittersweet and most of the ski resorts, especially when the systems have not been able to help them out very much. In fact, earlier today we spoke with the general manager here uh, at Bittersweet, Nick Ross, about just uh, what type of weather they actually look for when it comes to uh, helping out their business. Um, right now it's been a little struggle. I mean, you're getting the hours that we normally put in to make snow to get us open. We've kind of had to double that because the temperatures have been so warm. Um, but here, once we get the single digits, it's gonna we're going to be able to pump out so much snow that we're not going to know what to do with it all in a day. And that type of weather is on the way as we head to next week. Those cold temperatures means they'll be able to put out, he said, feet of snow. They'll be able to stockpile it, get it ready for the cold months ahead. And they are looking forward to what can hopefully be a healthy back into the season after what has been a slow start. Of course, if you want to come out, the weather's looking good for more ski conditions here. You can find more information. Just Google Bittersweet Ski Resort. For now, though, reporting live in Allegan County, meteorologist Michael Behrens, 13 on your side.